Yo, what is going on, my beautiful people? It is your boy, Lil Nan. Bring out this brand new video here today. And I'm back. 2023, baby. Yo, we've got a lot of things to do this year. I'm very, very, very excited. <laughs> We're back in the beautiful place, back in Wembley Park. Life is feeling good. And actually, it's some really good, productive things so far that happened this year. And it's actually the topic of the discussion we're going to have today. Uh, basically, what I'm going to talk about is the idea that sometimes you can think of some of the greatest ideas in the world but without action, they are nothing. They don't get too high on your thoughts. Um, so, the reason why I'm kind of having a thought and a conversation is basically because um, I just had a really good mate in my conversation, really good conversation with my mate um, over Instagram today. Uh, I'm talking about kind of just like business ideas, kind of like thoughts and motivation where we could be in 12 to 18 months and like all, we've all had these kind of conversations where like you feel like wow if we implement this life could change it's those conversations that might make you rich in 10 years like you're like oh wow this is amazing and you're literally gassing it up and you're like oh we might even do this holiday and life might be sick but then you gotta stop and think sometimes and be like but we ain't achieved anything yet we've not got to that point yet you're not living that life yet um and also that life you're thinking of becoming that business owner making that money doing these sports creating the physique all these goals they might want to achieve the thing you have to think about uh, in terms of that is that you need to it's gonna take a lot of discipline to achieve and that's something that a lot of people want to overlook it's like yes it's all great I mean, oh, I'm the biggest superstar in the world. Oh, I'm going to sell out shows. Oh, I'm going to have the biggest podcast. Oh, I'm going to, yeah, all these things. Oh, I'm going to be digital nomads. I'll make 10K for my bedroom and stuff like that. Like, yeah, all this stuff is great. And I applaud you for having those thoughts and being ambitious. But it's not something you achieve without actionable steps. And because the one reason I want to talk about this is because we've all kind of had, like I said, we've all had conversations. I've had them we're kind of drunk heart to hearts after a night out that Sunday afterwards that little huddle you do before you do any sports or before you go into a concert like all these times those DMs from someone you spoke to in a while and you start having a really deep conversation when you revisit family after a while like I've had a lot of these conversations in my life where I thought wow if I implement this my life's going to change but then it didn't and honestly I thought about it a lot kind of why this didn't happen why have I had these years where this year could have been amazing like this year feels like it could be amazing but so did 2020 so did 2021 maybe not those two years those two years were cancelled i can't lie <laughs> they're cancelled a bit but especially 2019 2018 um my dreams of being a millionaire by the time i was 25 i mean it could probably it could happen but it's a lot lot harder now than it was when i was 16. and you're thinking why did that not happen and the, the thing i put it down to um is not creating actionable steps so having the dream is great. Yes, I'm gonna, oh yeah, I'll have a million followers. Oh yeah, I'm gonna make this much money. Oh yeah. And you, you say all this stuff, but have you actually thought of the first actionable step? Or are you just, and the phrase is a bit crude, I can't lie, but the phrase is spot on. It's literally, you just mentally, you're like, it's mad. I, it's a phrase I say, man, I don't wanna say in public, but. <laughs> Bro, it's, bro, it's mental masturbation. Let's be honest, it is. Like you're literally, you're literally getting off on the thoughts of what life could be like if you became the best version of yourself. And it's like the audience of this sound great. All these holidays, the lifestyle, the social changes, uh, the economic changes. Like you just think, oh, this is sick. But you haven't, you haven't made any sort of steps. You haven't thought. You haven't thought of the first thing, you haven't thought all those steps before you can even make a penny, before you can even step on stage, before you can even start that podcast. You haven't thought of these steps, you've just gone, I have this idea, it can make me money, I'll oh, have to work on that. No, that's not how it works. You have to really think out, you have to think about discipline, and also you have to think about the sacrifice. A lot of people don't think about the sacrifice. There's a lot of things I could achieve this year. I'll go back to this conversation with my mate. There's a lot of things I could achieve this year. It could be the best year, one of the best years of my life. Just like you some of the ideas we had starting, starting businesses. We had ideas on um, managing music artists. We had ideas 
on boxing, having another fight. I had ideas on going to other countries, doing vlogs. I had ideas on growing my TikTok, growing the YouTube. Like, I had the idea of starting a podcast. Like, we had so many different ideas, and it sounds so amazing. And we sit there, and we have these conversations, we talk about how it could happen and everything and it's all good and you think yes i'll be a millionaire in three years and oh, life's so sweet oh look look where we are look where we can get to look at these people we're connecting with look at the views like, but what's the actionable step and the thing is having this conversation it felt so, so positive and uh, i meet a different country flying back and literally he was telling me about it and i was just like at the end i was like bro it all sounds great but I need to get on. Like, basically, I was there in my bag, getting ready to go to the gym. I was planning this conversation for about an hour. And I was like, bro, first step is just go to the gym, show some discipline. Do your work when you need to, go to work when you need to. Start making a plan, start factoring more time into your day. Don't get caught up in having these sort of cycles of just dreaming. Take your first steps and then move forward. And this is something, and the kind of best part of the conversation that I heard, um, and there's a lot of good, good positive things. It was just like, well, yeah, let's start waking up together. Let's start, and that sounds weird. Okay, pause. Um, uh, no, nah. it was like, let's start waking up at the same time. We can go, we live in the same building, we can work out together. Let's go, wake up at the same time, go for a run, do some exercise first thing in the morning. Let's tell each other what our plans are for the day. Let's work on it. Let's, 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 say, let's build something together. Let's work together, pull our money together if need be, and let's start something. It's, it sounds so amazing, but these aren't conversations that I've never had before. So the difference between, I think it kind of comes from being a bit older, a bit more wiser. I probably, I wouldn't touch my student at 18, I'm not gonna lie to you. But the difference is now is that I'm actually of an age where, and I've kind of had life experience where I'm like, the only way this works now is through action. I can't, you can't talk the talk anymore. Like, there was time when I was 18, 19, you obviously have a for a while now, and you see, I probably couldn't even talk the talk that well. I now know that I'm very good, I can talk the talk. I'm very confident in myself. I know my ability, I know that, I know how to talk the talk, I know how to sound like I'm a professional, I know how to sound like I can do this YouTube stuff. I know how I can sound, how to start a business. I can talk you through the theory. I've watched enough podcasts. I've watched enough people. I've kind of influenced that I respect to be able to rep reproduce what they say in a coherent way. But without the action, without discipline, it doesn't happen. And if this year is going to be successful, that's going to be the key indicator. To actually get in the routine, try and get sticking with it, especially when things go wrong. And just try and see through as much of it as we can. And if it fails, it fails. Especially in business, especially in entrepreneurship, stuff will fail. It's kind of inevitable at some point. You're gonna put investment in stuff and it's not gonna work out. And at that point, it's about how mentally resilient you are. And that is how, if you're gonna win in 2023, that's what you need to think about. It's not a big grand idea. They'll come and go. I've had business ideas, I've had business ideas in my notes since I was about 16 years old. Never enacted on one of them. So I'm not, I'm not short of business ideas, but I am short on all the business to start doing to learn is developing the discipline. So that's what I'm hoping to do. That's my plan for 2023. It's less really about the actual big goals. It's more just about building the character that goes and achieve those goals. But yeah, that's a bit of motivation from me. Glad to be back on this channel. We'll be uploading a lot more, a lot more ideas. It's a big year, it is a big year. But it's a big year because I've created a big year. And like I said in the TikTok I made, it's about creating your own look, it's not about relying on other people. And if you can create your own look on enough occasions, good things will happen on the scale of probabilities. So let's do it now. I've just arrived at the gym, we will be seen. So let's get going and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.